Tonight, all of the day's major developing stories here on Prime. New details about the lavish lifestyle Hunter Biden was accused of living instead of paying taxes. With these tax charges coming against the backdrop of the 2024 election, how could it impact his father's campaign? Plus, they fly to Kanko and then they fly to Tijuana. These are Chinese nationals usually and Turkish people. But that's maybe 20%. The other ones are coming through South America all the way up Central America by bus. Inside the growing landing spot for migrants from all over the world, the new influx at our country's border, where resources are dwindling. And... You know, Santa is really magical and smart, and he's going to know exactly where you are on Christmas. You don't have to worry about that. This year, the holidays look different for the thousands of people displaced by the Maui wildfires. But in this season of giving donations from all around the world, bringing joy to those who lost so much. Good evening. I'm Phil Lipoff in tonight for Lindsay Davis. Thanks so much for streaming with us. We are following those stories and much more including a school shooter sentenced. We go inside the emotional hearing where one by one survivors and loved ones of the victims got their chance to confront a killer. Plus a major medical breakthrough, the two FDA approved treatments researchers call a functional cure for sickle cell disease that could also treat other illnesses too. And iconic actor Willem Dafoe sits down with our Lindsay Davis to talk about his new dark comedy film, Poor Things in which he plays a Frankenstein-esque doctor who brings a woman to life, then finds a real appetite for life. Our correspondents are fanned out across the world covering those stories and more for us tonight.